Before attempting to approach or handle a horse, pause for a few minutes and assess the situation. Some guiding questions you need to answer are, what exactly am I trying to do? Organize in your own mind what needs to be done and exactly how you are to go about it. Is the animal amenable to what I want to do? You will need to decide by observing the animal and evaluating its demeanor. Is it nervous? Does it move away from your presence? Try to escape. Shuffle anxiously from foot to foot, trying to walk over you. Is it showing threatening behavior? Does it turn its hindquarters to you and threaten to kick? Does it flatten its ears and try to bite? Is it calm and attentive? Does it show normal inquisitive behavior? Appear interested in its surroundings and not worried by your presence? Is it sick? Does it seem dull, disinterested in any happenings, too listless to move away? Observe and note any abnormal clinical findings. Is the area or enclosure suitable for my purposes? Is the stable too big, too small, and or too light? Should I use a small paddock or an open space? Do I have sufficient suitable equipment and do I need a handler? Will I need any equipment for restraint? Is a halter satisfactory? Do I need a handler to assist or do I need expert assistance? If you need helpers, explain clearly and logically to them what you require them to do and how to do it. Is the situation safe for you and the handler? The usual handler can assist to keep an animal calm or you can even employ another calm horse to assist. Remember, every time you handle a horse, you are in effect training the horse. For example, when you release the pressure immediately when she's following you, she will know that she performed the correct procedure and will continue this behavior.